Nanosail D was a small satellite which was to have been used by NASA's Ames Research Center to study the deployment of a solar sail in space. It was a three-unit CubeSat measuring 30 by 10 by 10 centimeters, 12 times 3.9 times 3.9 inches, with a mass of 4 kilograms, 8.8 .8 pounds. The satellite was lost shortly after launch due to a problem with the rocket carrying it. However, a replacement, NanoSail D2, was launched in 2010 to complete its mission. Topic. Spacecraft Nanosail D was to have been deployed on the third flight of the Falcon 1 rocket, which was launched from Omlek Island at 3.34 Coordinated Universal Time on 3 August 2008. One of two CubeSats aboard, along with PreSat, it was a secondary payload to the Trailblazer which was to have been operated by the Operationally Responsive Space Office of the United States Department of Defense. The launch was conducted by SpaceX, and also carried a space burial payload for Celestis. Two minutes and 40 seconds after launch, the spent first stage of the rocket was jettisoned, however, unexpected residual thrust caused it to recontact the second stage, which resulted in the rocket being thrown off course. Unable to achieve orbit, the rocket and payloads fell into the Pacific Ocean. Nanosail D was to have been operated in a low Earth orbit with a perigee of 330 kilometers (210 miles), an apogee of 685 kilometers (426 miles), and nine degrees of inclination. It would have been operational for around seven days, after which time it would have been expected to run out of power. Its solar sail had an area of 10 square meters, 110 square feet. The satellite was developed and tested in 4 months. NanoSail D2 was built as a ground spare for NanoSail D. Following the launch failure of NanoSail D in August 2008, NanoSail D2 was launched on a Minotaur IV rocket in November 2010 and deployed from the FASTSAT satellite. Topic. See also List of CubeSatsalar Sail CUBESATSLIGHTSAIL-1 Near-Earth Asteroid Scout